Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing well. I know it's been a while since I've uploaded, but I have something cool that I wanted to show you. Some of you may remember that I used to sell ichthyosaur pins on my Etsy shop, but I sold out quite a few years ago now. I also design enamel pins as part of my day job, but I haven't designed anything just for me for a while, so when a sponsor reached out about pins, I was excited to give it another try. GSJJ is part of a family of companies, including BPS, CustomPins.ca, and CustomSticker.com that have been manufacturing promotional materials for over 20 years. Obviously, doing this as part of my job, I'm very familiar with the design process for making pins, and it was super easy to just send them my vector files and receive proofs, but they also have this pretty cool design program on their website, so you can design things straight on here. You don't have to be, you know, a fully decked out professional graphic designer like I am. You can do it on their little online client, which is honestly pretty cool, and they have like tons of templates that you can start with. So. If you are looking to get anything manufactured, there are a bunch of links in the description below as well as pinned in the comments, so go check them out. For my design, I wanted to try something that was partly medieval inspired and partly dinosaurs, so I played around with this heraldic allosaurus idea. Here are some proofs in my sketchbook checking out the size, uh, and behind here you saw the sketch process. So I ended up going with these two inch enamel pins, which we should probably get out of the box. So here is the set of stickers that I got with this design. It's got a score in the back, so they're super easy to peel off. They're glossy stickers, uh, and you can see here that the color's printed really well. Everything's nice and crisp, and the gloss is actually really pretty. I tend to be more of a matte guy. Um, but I really do like the gloss on these and for the pin here I got the black nickel plating so it's dark but it has some shine to it and I got this like reddish orange orangey red color for the hard enamel and I even was able to select red rubber backs for these um, which is very novel to me I like the rubber backs much better than the butterfly clasps or whatever they call them. <laughs> I really like how these turned out. I actually wasn't quite sure what I thought about them at first and it took me a while to film this video but now that I'm seeing them again I'm very pleased with them. I will be listing a few of the stickers and the pins on my Etsy shop, but I'm going to be keeping most of them for myself and for my friends. 
This isn't exactly a return to YouTube, but all of my videos are still available for you to watch. Um, I'm still active on Instagram, at ThoughtsUpNorth. I still have a Twitter, or X as they're calling it, um, just so that I date this video. Um, but I also made a Blue Sky account, so that will be at ThoughtsUpNorth as well, if you want to follow me. My links and the sponsor links are in the description and comments below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you around the net. Bye!